everyone, welcome back to our channel. So today, as you can tell, I am gonna be sharing with you what is going in my kids' Easter baskets this year. I'm gonna start with Preston's because he is obviously the little baby. This is his. It is the small size um, Sabrina basket with the small bunny liner. And it is the taupe bunny. He also has the gray font. It says Preston. And I just think it's super, super cute. And it is kind of an investment. These can get very pricey, especially if you go with the large. Um, but I went with the small because I don't think that they need like a huge, huge basket. I just figured that we would stick with the, the smalls because they're still really good sized. Um, but yeah. Then inside we have just these this iridescent uh, grass from Spritz from Target, which I think was $2 a bag. And I have two bags in here. So it's like poofy and you know what I mean? Just very fluffy to stick things and keep it kind of raised. First things first are these cute little blue bunny um, bubbles. These are 98 cents from Walmart, so they weren't super expensive. And even though he's gonna be small enough, I figured it would be fun to still like blow them and stuff like that for and him. I really was hoping that Shop Disney would have put their Minnie and Mickey bunny plushes on um, like now. But they haven't yet. I don't know if they will. I'm kind of hoping that they will still because they're super, super cute. Because I've seen them on the Shop Disney UK. And they're so, so darn cute. I'm hoping that they release them here soon so I can get my hands on them for them. And they can just enjoy them, obviously, the whole spring season. And obviously, you know, any other month after. Because I'm not going to just put them away. But, um... These are the plushes that I went with, obviously, instead, because they weren't on there. Um, this one is pretty useful for Preston, since obviously he's not going to be even a month old yet. And it is just the little lamb, like the swaddle me, like mommy melody or something like that lamb. But it has like all like the different uh, sounds and stuff like that you can put on here for them. And you can attach it to like their car seat or their crib. I figured it would be... A cute little thing for him as well as like lambs are iconic for Easter and just spring in general. I did get him some shoes and they are just these cute little this one you um, little shoes boat shoes from Target and I just think that they would look so cute with some shorts and such um, for summer and spring. Next thing is is his outfit that's gonna be obviously what he wears that day he's gonna stay in something very very comfy I'm not gonna dress him all up just simply because he is gonna be not even a month old so I almost feel terrible if I was to put jeans on like jean shorts or something on him I just I'm not gonna do that so he is just getting a little sleeper and it's the just one you blue bunny sleeper and it has just the little bunny feet and it also has a little cotton tail on the back which is so cute he did get a three month because I f mm, I feel like he's gonna be out he's already gonna be outgrown he's already gonna outgrow uh, his newborn size by then so I'm getting like zero to threes or threes um, in his clothing by that time so that is the outfit he's gonna be wearing um, then I did get him some bunny ears. Obviously, he's going to be really little, so he's not going to, you know what I mean, keep these on for very long. Um, but I did, um, I did get some for Charlotte as well. So I figured it'd be super cute to get them in their little bunny ears. Then I also got him um, the Disney Baby, my first Easter book. I love these books because they are so cute and they babies and kids just enjoy the touch and feels. And that is just what is in this book. So we have Flower's Tail. The flowers are bumpy with glitter. And then this chick is like, um, like I don't mean like, like, velvety, like the velvety feel to it. And then there's the little bow, Minnie's bow that's satiny. And then we have, this one's Charlotte's favorite. And it is the sticky jelly beans. She loves her stickies. <laughs> And then we have Mickey's soft bunny ears and stuff. So I figured this one would be a really good 
book for him. And he is getting pajamas, but these are his Easter like pajamas. And they're just these cute little Minnie and Mickey pastel pajamas. Again, this is a size zero to three, because I, I think he's gonna be out of newborns by then. And then he can also wear this obviously longer. But it is so cute, and I just, ugh, I just can't wait to see him in them. They're gonna be so cute. And he's gonna be so comfy. So I will have everything linked down below as well. I also, even though Preston is gonna be super small, I did get him a movie because it is a tradition that I wanna carry out. And it's just, I just got him the Peter Rabbit Spring into Adventure. Very, very last thing, since he is gonna be young, I keep saying that, but it is true. I did get him a little carrot teether. This is the Infantino one. And it is super, super cute. It has like the little bumpies and everything like that and just the handles for him to grip and stuff. I felt like this was a good alternative because it's still like a food item. I got that one for him. And then now we'll move on to Charlotte's basket. So again, this is her basket. She has the white Sabrina basket in the size small and then also the white bunny liner. And she has the same font as well as the gray. Then she has the same grass. Charlotte has some pink bubbles as well. I figured, you know, both kids deserve some bubbles. And then for her plush, she's getting this cute little Ella bunny from Animal Adventure. They are seriously the cutest and the most softest plushes I've ever, ever felt before. And they have literally the cutest characteristics ever. Like, look at this bunny. But yeah. Then for her shoes, since she needs new sandals, I got these ones for her from Captain Jack. They just have the cute little white bow, I mean, flowers on them. And then they also have the silver glitter at the bottom. Love these little strappy um, sandals. So these are her sandals this year, since her sandals last year no longer fit her. For her outfit for that day, we found this dress at TJ Maxx. It's just super cute, super lightweight, and just, I love the ruffles so much on the sleeves. So that is her outfit. And then also she is getting some bunny ears and they match Preston's. So I'm gonna get a picture of them in their matching ears. Her Easter pajamas, she is getting the same, same um, Minnie and Mickey ones but hers is obviously a two-piece and then here are the pants that go with it just has the little teal blue on the bottom on the cuff so those are her pajamas and for her book she is getting the easter bunny is coming to my town it's super cute all the colors the pastels and stuff love it and the easter bunny is adorable like look at that little bunny illustration he's so cute so yeah, I'm super excited. I think she's going to enjoy this book. She loves her books. So you can never go wrong with books. Then the movie she's getting, she's getting Dora's Easter Adventure. She has never watched Dora before, but I think she'll really enjoy Dora. So I did get her that movie. And then um, for her last item, she got goldfish crackers. And it's just the cute little spring eastery packaging and stuff like that she loves her goldfish so i thought this would be a good alternative for candy because she has a ton still from halloween and christmas but that is everything that's going in my kids easter baskets this year so if you guys want to stick around just for a little bit longer i am going to put them together so i'll do kind of like a montage of me putting everything into their basket. Before I do go and before I start that, I'm gonna show you guys my 38 week bump. Definitely, definitely wanna have this for memories cause he probably will be my last baby if I can't convince my husband for one more. So definitely wanna get as much um, of my bump documented as I can. So yeah, this is my 38 week bump. And then I'll lift it up so you can kinda see a little bit better too. <laughs> Sorry about my cats, but they're down here hanging out with me. So yeah, this is my 38 week bump. I finally got this line. I can't remember what the line is called, but it's very light compared to Charlotte's. 
but this definitely showed up in like the last week or two. Now we'll get right on into me putting everything into their basket. 